CNBC's Phil LeBeau live in Chicago. Phil, what can we expect at dealerships this weekend? Uh, slim picking, Scott, and that's because you have the chip shortage, which means there's a low supply of new vehicles out there. So here's what's going to happen. If you are looking for a particular vehicle, you are going to have to search really hard to find exactly what you want. And even if you find it, do not expect the dealers to make a deal. They are not offering big incentives and rebates right now. So, okay, it's not a buyer's market. We, we get that. But how much more are people paying compared to a year ago? Oh, a lot more. It depends on the vehicle. A good example is the F-150, best-selling vehicle in this country. If you bought it a year ago, you were paying about $5,000 less than what you're going to pay now if you go out to a dealership. And this means people are taking out bigger loans, Scott. On the new car side, they're taking out loans that are about $1,500 greater than they were a year ago. And that monthly payment, by the way, is edging closer to $600. And it's even worse on the used side. You're looking at used loans that are now you know, running over $22,000. And those people who are buying a used vehicle with a loan, their monthly payments are now over $400. All right, Phil. Thank you. Phil LeBeau for us tonight. Shepard Smith here. Thanks for watching CNBC on YouTube.